Welcome to the 2020 National Honor Society induction ceremony. My name is Janae Peterson, and I am honored to serve as the advisor for the Radnor High School chapter of the National Honor Society. The National Honor Society was founded in 1921 by Edward Ryerson, principal of the Fifth Avenue High School in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. The society has flourished to close to 100 years, and today there are more than 12,500 chapters across the country. The society is part of the office of the National Association of Secondary School Principals. The National Honor Society is the nation's premier organization to recognize outstanding high school students. More than just an honor roll, NHS serves to honor students who have demonstrated excellence in the areas of character, scholarship, leadership, and service. These four main purposes have guided chapters of NHS from the beginning. To create enthusiasm for scholarship, to stimulate a desire to render service, to promote leadership, and to develop character in the students of secondary schools. These purposes are also translated into the criteria used for membership selection in each local chapter. The Society chose as its emblem the keystone and the lit torch to show how students demonstrate a willingness to lead so that others may follow the lights. At this time, I would like to introduce the president of the Radnor chapter of the National Honor Society, Jane O'Grady. We are here to formally recognize those students who have been selected by the faculty of our school for successfully completing their candidacy and being inducted as new members of our NHS chapter. For current members, we hope this will remind you of the standards of excellence you too are charged with maintaining as members of the nation's oldest, largest, and most prestigious student recognition program. Throughout the year, members of our chapter serve as role models for other students. In addition to the strong academic records, which establish the eligibility for membership, our chapter members are leaders in many student organizations, and we serve our school and community through many activities. It is at this time that we proclaim that membership in the Radnor High School chapter of the National Honor Society has been earned by these candidates through the effective demonstration of the four qualities that serve as the standards for society. At this time, I would now like to introduce this year's officers. Vice President Jessica Gustorf, Secretary Kira Lee, and Treasurer Lily Kelly. We will now review these qualities for the candidates. We begin with scholarship. Scholarship denotes a commitment to learning. A student is willing to spend hours in reading and study, knowing the lasting benefits of a cultivated mind. We should continue to learn even when formal education has ended. For human education ends only with the end of life. Knowledge is one of the great elements in life which leads to the highest success, and it can be acquired in only one way, through diligence and effort. Learning furnishes the lamp by which we read the past, the torch guiding us to understand the present and the light that illuminates the future. Candidates have the charge to continually expand their world through the opportunities inherent in scholarship. Service. Service can be established in the routine of the day's work where many opportunities arise to help others both at school and in the community. A willingness to work for the benefit of those in need without monetary compensation or public recognition is the quality we seek in our membership and promote for the entire student body. We are committed to volunteering our time and talents to the creation of a better tomorrow. Leadership should exert a wholesome influence on the school. In taking initiative in the classroom and in school activities, the real leader strives to train and aid others to reach their common goals of success. The price of leadership is sacrifice, the willingness to yield one's personal interests for the interests of others. A leader has self-confidence and will go forward when others hesitate. No matter what power and resources may exist in a school, community, or nation, they are ineffectual without the guidance of a wise leader. Leadership is always needed. Thus, to lead is a meaningful and substantive charge to each of our members.
character. Character is the force within the individuals that distinguishes each person from others. It creates for each of us our individuality, our goodness. It is that without which no one can respect oneself nor hope to attain the respect of others. It is the force of character that guides one through life. Once developed, grows steadily within. Character is achieved and not received. It is the product of constant thought and action, the daily striving to make the right choice. The problem of character is the problem of self-control. We must be in reality what we wish to appear to others, to be rather than to be seen. By demonstrating such qualities as respect, responsibility, trustworthiness, fairness, caring, and citizenship, we may hope to prove by example that we value character. We will now introduce our new members. Naya Anand, Natalie Enfuso, Deborah Armstrong, Claudia Ball, Avery Barber, Hannah Baumgardner, Sydney Bennett, Chase Bentley, Catherine Bajukas, Peyton Breck, Preston Breck, Julie Breedveld, Teresa Brennan, Elise Budziak, Samuel Chaninson, Noah Choi, Audrey Collins, Noah Conan, Lucas Conlin, Caroline Constable, Casey Collin, Jane Diutolo, Helia Darabi, Josie Derrick, Margaret Davis, Hope Delaney, Natalie Denhart, Olivia De Ovidio, Parker Drew, Isabel Deputy, Anjali Engstrom, Caleb Yoon, Michael Farhi, Lindsay Feinberg, Sophia Floody, Ryan Fox, Caitlin Fram, Alexis Free, Ava Gallia, Nandita Ganesh, Eleanor Graves, Alexa Green, Samantha Guillaume, Jacob Halbertstadt, Emily Harris, Benjamin Hart, Helene Hartman, Lucy Henkel, Ava Hernandez, Reese Hillman, Justin Holly. Ryan Hornbaker, Teresa Hughes, Redima Jane, Abby Jansen, Annika Joswall, Nathaniel Jean, Catherine Johnstone, George Cadaville, Stephen Cadaville. Sebastian Caper Barcelata, Petros Karamanides, Nathan Kellerman, Rishi Khanna, Hyunjin Kim, Noel Kuhn, James Kurtz, Nicholas Levine, Jungmin Lee, Caitlin. Lee, Leah Lenthal Cleary, Danielle Lomazov, Minnie Madden, Rina Matsumoto, Manito Matsuka, Jillian Matunas, Cynthia Maz, Riley Mazalupi, Allison Miltenberger, Ariana Moore, Julia Morrison, 
Ryan Mosovitz, Megan Moyer, Kendall Mulligan, Audrey Needland, Justin Norian, Probgun Oberoi, Tillin Ogutu, Hyman O, Henry Pyatt, Trisha Priyadarshi, Grace Purcell, Tyler Quinn, Anna Ramesh, Audrey Rasmussen, William Rager, Amelia Reinholdt, Maya Rigler, Benjamin Robinson, Shreya Rupesh, Aaron Ryder, Kaylin Schrader, Zachary Schultz, Tellian Schwarz, Nora C. Schultz, Noah Simone Dobin, Sullivan Sims, Josephine Solomon, Chase Stefano, Christina Su, Tian Tran, Daniel Tropiano, Sophia Tuig, Karina Vale, Kelsey Wakiyama, Delaney Walsh, Amasha Wickramasinga, John Williams, Zoriana Whitmer, Shashank Yala Manchi, Deanna Wan, Rebecca Zajak, Aaron Zhu. It is at this time that we proclaim that membership in the Radnor High School chapter of the National Honor Society has been earned by these candidates through the effective demonstration of the four qualities that serve as the standards for the society. I pledge to maintain high scholastic standing, to hold as a fundamental and worthy, an untarnished character, to endeavor intelligently and courageously, to be a leader and to give of myself freely in service to others. In doing so, I shall prove myself worthy of a place in the National Honor Society. Congratulations and welcome to the National Honor Society.